Hello Fit Buzzers and welcome back to the Convenience Workout. That is the No Nonsense Butt Building Convenience Workout. Why? Because I know a lot of you will be away a lot this summer and you won't always have access to a gym. So we have a convenience workout where all you need is you and the resistance band. No extra tips, tricks or hacks that you've seen in previous workouts. It's just you and the resistance band and that's it. So. What are we going to do today in your hotel workout? Because I know in a hotel is where you perform most of these workouts if you are away. Right, so we're going to perform three exercises. We're just going to do three times eight rep range, a rep set range, and that's it. Simple, convenient workout to keep you in shape while you're away, and that's it. And it's no nonsense butt building because we're going to focus on building. Focus on building your butt or working your butt. We're going to give your butt a rest, work your upper body, and we're going to give your shoulders a rest and then work your back. And the first exercise we're going to start off with is the resistance band donkey kick. So all you're going to do is get your band, get your handle and wrap both of the ends inside the handle. And then what you're going to do is, is to stick the handle around your foot like so. Then all you're going to do is make sure that you Place it in between your thumb and your finger, and you get on your knees, on all fours, and then what you do is keep your face, keep your face placed downwards, and you kick back and fully extend your leg like so. Here we go. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Give it a break there. Did ten reps there, but uh, between eight and ten reps. As long as you do that, that amount. So here we go again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Give it a little rest. And again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And we switch legs. Remember, you can use the heaviest resistance or the lightest resistance. It's a convenience workout. So all you're doing is just keeping your body alive. And make sure that you that you don't die and lose your edge or lose that pump, as I like to call it. Lose that pump. You know, you don't work out for a few weeks. What happens? You lose your pump. And we don't want that to happen. So, do the same thing again. Between 8 to 10 reps. But, uh, let's the donkey kick it. So, here we go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Six, seven, eight. Give it a little rest. And one, two, three, four, five. 
six, seven, eight. Give it a little rest. The rules are the same as the previous workouts. It's the no rest policy. That's what these 15 minute workouts are all about. Whether it's a convenience workout or any of the other targeted 15 minute workouts. So let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and now we switch to our upper body. Remember, these are just short workouts, not 30 minutes, not 45 minutes, just short, quick workouts that will give you your results. Because that is what you're after. Shred to sexy, get those lines, lose the fat, no more muffin top, all that good stuff. So, what we're going to do now is focus on upper body and we're going to do upright rows. So, keep our legs completely straight, parallel, keep our feet pointed forwards. Stand straight, and then what we do is we're going to raise our hands up, keep our elbows above our hands, and raise our hands to our shoulder level. So let's go another three times eight. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Give it a little rest. And here we go again. One, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now remember, no nonsense butt building. It's all about more than just the butt, right? That's the, that's, the, that's the secret right there. The key to building a sculpt in an S-curve and a fantabulous butt, it's all about focusing on the other muscle groups to bring the best out of your butt to make it look fantastic along with the rest of your S-curve. So let's go one more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And there we go. That exercise, regardless of what tools you'll use, will always, always challenge you. Honestly, it will always challenge you. And that's how you make sure that you have no fat areas above here. Alright, nice and toned and sexy and shredded. And, uh, yeah. So here we're going to do the, uh, 
the pull aparts. Now, the pull aparts is an exercise that you can do with a band and make sure you choose the band with the heaviest res resistance. Now, to increase resistance, all I did there was just wrap it around my hand on both of my hands. That increases the resistance. It's really that simple. And all you've got to do is keep your hands at about eye level right in front of you. And all you're going to do is pull apart. So keep your legs slightly bent. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Give it a rest. Now, unlike the previous exercise where you would feel it in your traps, in this exercise you're going to feel it in your back, at the top of your back and the uh, back of your shoulders. So you're going to feel it. So, no rest. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, yeah, very, very intense. Still, even with just resistance bands, no other tools or anything. Um, just creative ways to add resistance in a very convenient workout. Performing exercises that are very easy and convenient to perform. So, one more. One. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. <sighs> Woo! And that's it. Wake up in the morning in your hotel, come back from lunch, I don't know, you might even come back for a party and you want to work out, you know, that might even work for you. Point is, it's just a nice convenient workout that you can do when you're away. All you've got to make sure is that you have your trusty bands with you when you fly. So that's the convenient workout for you, done for you. And I'll see you in another 15 minute targeted Bit Buzz workout. Bye bye.